deadly wrong way wreck. Two people are killed and an infant airlifted to a hospital in critical condition. It happened along Route 50 in Anne Arundel County, shutting down the highway for hours. WJZ is live. George Solis updates the investigation for us. George. Yeah, good evening, Mary. Tonight, police confirming the identity of that driver killed in that head-on crash as Robert Skidmore. The woman killed is 22-year-old Laura Murphy of Salisbury. Her passenger, that 14-month-old infant who was medevaced to Johns Hopkins. The inexplicable horror unfolding midday Wednesday. Response from motor vehicle collision. Route 50 East on the ramp to Route 2 North. Sky Chopper 13 over the scene of the fatal wrong way crash on Route 50 in Annapolis. The resulting head-on collision so violent, Maryland State Police along with teams of first responders shut down both east and westbound lanes of traffic for hours to airlift the injured, which included a 14th month old. Response units en route for motor vehicle collision with entrapment. One man ended up trapped in his car. About 4 o'clock this afternoon is when that 66-year-old man was extricated from his vehicle. WJZ now learning that man later died. Investigators say a number of 911 calls reported the driver, now identified as 22-year-old Laura Murphy, was driving in the wrong direction. Now, according to police, Murphy was driving westbound in the eastbound lanes, approximately one quarter mile east of the Seven River Bridge. When the crash occurred, it is still unknown where she got onto Route 50 in the first place. Witnesses describing the wreckage as unlike anything they've ever seen. It was just really sad, you know, like watching um, the cars just be like in ditches and, you know, like the white sheets and, you know, like the helicopters and the trauma unit. Traffic also a nightmare. It was terrible. Uh, it was mostly on the uh, side roads were backed up as well. According to the Federal Highway Administration in the U.S., nearly three to 400 people are killed each year in wrong way crashes. And just like in this case, involve head on or sideswipe collisions at high speeds that end up being more severe. Now, at the time of the crash, that infant was reported to have critical injuries. Mary, no word yet on his condition tonight. We're live tonight, George Solis, WJZ Eyewitness News. All right, George, thank you. A third crash victim was unharmed, but their car did sustain some minor damage.